Hello, hello, it's Miz. Welcome to my channel if it's your first time here and welcome back if you have been here before. You guys, I'm so excited. Right now we're about to open up the Harry Potter calendar and I, I just, I'm beside myself. I saw this on YouTube and fell in love and made a commitment and it came all the way from England just for me. I'm not a huge Harry Potter fan, but I do like the movies and I do enjoy it and I do appreciate people that are successful with theming. And I feel confident that this box nails that based on the two items that I saw. On the front of the box, it says premium potions themed advent calendar includes jewelry and accessories, wizarding world of Harry Potter, and then this this slides off. Just like my last calendar, there is a little sleeve on the outside of the calendar that contains all the spoilers that we are not going to look at. And if we were giving this as a gift, super easy. We can see what's inside and like evaluate whether we wanna give that as a gift and then just take it off. And the re recipient is never the wiser. Look at how cool this is. This is like a little trunk. These are actual pieces of hardware. And actually, I'm gonna see if I can just put the camera on the box. I want you to see the actual box. Really wanted you to see the details. Metal hardware here, looks like it's tooled leather with rivets. Let's get started. This is why I fell in love with this calendar. Like, look at how beautiful that is. Porcupine parts, boom slang skin, lace wing flies. Like this is just so beautiful. Scarab beetle mixture, armadillo bile, horned slugs, and rat spleen. Like I love it. I love it. Number one. First off, the first thing I'm noticing pulling this out is that this is not made out of flimsy paper. This is an incredibly heavy cardboard box. This is very sturdy. It feels almost like wood. And the number one box says, this is an extremely dangerous potion. It is a lock with a key to lock your potions box. Ridiculous how cute that is, right? Ridiculous. The drawers are also all out of order, so you kind of have to hunt your next box. Day number two is a Harry Potter ornament. It is dated 2023, so that's nice. Very pretty, and it feels like it's well-made. It's I feel like it's an aluminum ornament. And look how deep this goes. This, this is incredible. Incredible presentation. Day number three. Oh, it's our first vial. You can see the potions inside. It's a potions pen. Very cute. Day number four is in the Hogwarts Apothecary box. Day number four is a potions scrunchie. It has Hogwarts, the sorting hat, or maybe it's just a Hogwarts. It's a Hogwarts scrunchie. Very nice. Day number five. Is that Fox the Phoenix? Who is that? I'm lacking in my Harry Potter knowledge. I just realized that behind these vials, there is a whole other set of drawers. Very cool, right? Day number six is down here in one of these bottles. Oh wow, and there's boxes behind these bottles too. Day number six, Polyjuice Potion. And inside are these tiny earrings. They both say Love Potion. Nice. Day number seven is in one of our vials. This one is green. This is another pen with a charm. This says Alahamora. Day number eight on the bottle, it says from the apothecary of Horace Slughorn. Inside is a tiny, tiny little charm that says Obliviate. Day number nine. Day number nine is a Luna Lovegood lanyard. This is covered with pictures of her glasses, Oh, that charm we got. Maybe that was Luna Lovegood and not the Phoenix. It has a lion, a rabbit, some shoes. Oh yeah, her radish earrings. I do remember that. Very cute. Day number nine. Day number 10 is the final item in this section. It's a Harry Potter pencil. Day number 11 is our final short small vial in the front. It says potion number 11 and everything else is way too small for my aging eyes to read. Inside is another charm and this features Hogwarts with stars and a glitter enamel in the background. The enamel work on this and the earrings is lovely. Day number 12 is our first box that's in the back of our apothecary chest. These are awesome. They have little ribbon pulls, so it's easy for me to get out. Oh my gosh, and there's more behind it. How wild, okay. Inside is an Expelliarmus hairpin. That's very clever. It's subtle, it's a piece of jewelry. I 
I think that is a total hit. All right, now we're on to day 13, which is one of my favorite numbers. It's right here. It's labeled Mandrake Elixir. That's wild. These boxes stayed up, but I can see there's a whole other layer back there. Day number 13 is a Lumos pen. Day 14 is right above it. And this is labeled Frog Parts Mixture. And inside is the charm bracelet for our charms. And it has a Harry Potter charm already on it. Day 15 is a tiny silver charm that says Expelliarmus and goes on your charm bracelet. Day 16. Day 16 is an Expectro Patronum bookmark. Day 17 claims that it holds rat spleen mixture. We'll see about that. They were totally fibbing. It is a sorting hat hair tie. Day 18 is extremely poisonous. It's a stupefy hairpin. Day 19 is the first box in the third layer on this side. This is tincture number three, Drought of Peace, and it's also from the Slugworth Apothecary. Inside is a beautiful cauldron necklace, and I imagine you could also put your charms on here too. It has the same circular chain. Day 20 is another pen for Wingardium Leviosa. Day 21 is not an elixir like the box said. It is a friendship bracelet. Super cute to go with those earrings. Day 22 is another bookmark. 23 says it's a Bulbadox. Inside is a Deathly Hallows friendship bracelet. And then our final day, day 24. And inside is a big, beautiful key ring or bag charm. I loved that box. That was a great deal. I think it cost me $107 and I had to wait two weeks for it but every single detail in that box was stellar. There were so many layers. There were three layers and I think two separate compartments. Really, really awesome. I have zero complaints. I also felt like I got a lot of bang for my buck. It was a great experience. I had a great time opening it. Just incredibly thoughtful. It's very apparent to me that the people that put this box together love Harry Potter and want to share their enthusiasm. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope that you have a great rest of your day and I will see you soon. Oh, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.